Hey guys, Nash here back with another outstanding ROM and today we are going to review Toxic OS which is based on latest Android 8.1 but looks like Android P. So let's get started. So as I said this ROM looks like Android P, I mean the whole setting menu layout has been themed to look like Android P and it comes with latest security patch of June. So guys this is the new ROM with new team. This is Toxic OS 1.0. So with future updates you might see more development. And talking about updates, this ROM has inbuilt OTA updates so it's very easy for you to update the ROM. So guys this is the kind of home screen you get from very first boot. It comes with lean launcher as default launcher and that's an outstanding thing because lean launcher is one of my personal favorite launcher also. So in the color theme engine you get light, dark and black. Along with that you get two extra themes called toxic and hazard. And when it comes to accent colors, there are plenty of colors to choose from. Some of them are even funny named and the name of the colors are Playboy and Deep Valley. So yeah, that's a good thing if you are looking for customization. And guys, this is the only custom ROM which prompts you when you restart your phone. None of the other ROMs does that. So that's the unique feature number two. Apart from that you get always on display feature which is my personal favorite feature in almost any Oreo custom room. Now this feature is similar to Samsung S8 and S9 but if you don't have AMOLED screen this feature will drain your battery. And if you are old Android user then you might know how difficult it is to change system fonts in stock Android. You have to root or install subsetum theme but this room provides different fonts to you without installing any third party app. It includes some of my favorite fonts like Google Sense and Ubuntu. This room is super fast thanks to the kernel. Multitasking is easy, so far I had only one random reboot. Unfortunately there is no smart pixel feature to give you that extra battery life. Battery life seems average to me, I got 6 hours of screen on time so nothing special over there. In my Redmi Note 4 there is no Gcam but if you flash this room on OnePlus 5T it comes with pre-installed Gcam. So that's a good thing. And now I will show you which phones are supported by this room. So with that outstanding boot animation and fonts pre-installed and so many color themes, I'm going to give this room 4.3 out of 5. If you want that font feature then you can download this room for many smartphones. All the links will be in the description box below. And if you appreciate my work on this channel then give a like to this video. This is Nash and I will see you tomorrow. Ooh.